Young Sheldon final images offer a grim update for Big Bang Theory five years after it ended. Hello everyone, my name is Marcus G. Welcome to my channel. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a like up. Sheldon's return in the Young Sheldon final hints at changes in the Pasadena gang post, the Big Bang Theory's final. Young Sheldon final images suggest that adult Sheldon has moved out of his and Amy's old The Big Bang Theory apartment. The lack of the Big Bang Theory references in Young Sheldon's final also implies that the couple may not be as close with the Pasadena gang as they once were. Jim Parsons is back as Sheldon in the new Young Sheldon final images, which also reveals the grim reality of the Pasadena gang after The Big Bang Theory ended. As an attempt to tie the shows together, Young Sheldon is debuting Parsons' adult Sheldon in the show's upcoming special one-hour send-off that will air on May 16. Despite being involved in the series from the get-go as a producer and narrator, this marks the actor's first time returning as the socially inept genius in front of the camera since the emotional The Big Bang Theory finale in 2019. Certain details about what to expect from adult Sheldon's cameo in the much-anticipated finale have already been revealed thanks to an official release from CBS. Currently, Young Sheldon Season 7, Episode 14 is titled Memoir, effectively backing up long-standing theories about why adult Sheldon is looking back at his childhood in the show. Subsequently, the network has already released the first images of Parsons' return as Sheldon in the Young Sheldon finale. While they don't come with additional context, the stills offer a lot of information specifically with regard to the Pasadena Gang post, The Big Bang Theory. After seven seasons, Young Sheldon officially solves its oldest, The Big Bang Theory plot hole concerning Lance Barber's role in the franchise. Aside from the implications of adult Sheldon and Mayim Bialik's appearance in the Young Sheldon finale, their cameo also offers CBS the chance to give the public a much-needed update about how their friends are doing. It has been half a decade since the Pasadena gang was last seen on the small screen, and while the Big Bang Theory tied pretty much all lingering storylines in its finale, some of its arcs would benefit from any additional information. That includes Penny and Leonard's pregnancy arc and Raj's continued search for a life partner. Unfortunately, the Young Sheldon final images don't feature any clues about either plot, but they reveal that Sheldon and Amy have already moved out of their apartment 4B unit. As Penny's old single flat, it was too small to have an extra room for an office. It also doesn't look like it is from apartment 4A based on the stained glass window. It's likely that Sheldon and Amy no longer live in an apartment building. Instead, they have moved to a proper house, which makes sense considering their growing family. The Big Bang Theory ended with the status quo for the friend group maintained. However, this reveals that the Pasadena gang has already lost its long-standing location set up. Living across from each other made it easier for them to maintain their friendship. The Big Bang Theory ended with the status quo for the friend group maintained. However, as their lives changed in the years that followed, they had to make difficult decisions to benefit their respective families. It's curious, however, if Leonard and Penny are still in apartment 4, A since it's a bigger unit. Aside from Sheldon and Amy moving out of the Big Bang Theory apartment, another grim indication of the current status of the Pasadena gang can be seen in how the office is decorated. On the wall, his Nobel Prize in Physics medal and certificate are framed. To the side appears to be the same atomic sculpture from apartment 4A, the one that he and Leonard fixed during the Big Bang Theory final time jump. The frames behind Sheldon have a snap of him and Amy during their Nobel win and an old family image taken at the Cooper's house. No photos of Leonard and Penny with the rest of the squad, which would have been the easiest way to reference them if they don't have any cameos. Interestingly, there's a lack of any traces of the Pasadena gang. No photos of Leonard and Penny with the rest of the squad, which would have been the easiest way to reference them if they don't have any cameos. This is disappointing for those who are expecting a more substantial reveal of how they are doing, let alone those who are hoping for the young Sheldon final to have a makeshift The Big Bang Theory reunion. Beyond that, this suggests that Sheldon and Amy may not be as close with their old friends anymore, which is upsetting considering their history. Young Sheldon was born out of the success of The Big Bang Theory.
tackling Sheldon's origin story was the best way to expand the universe, considering the viewer's familiarity with the character. However, young Sheldon has come a long way from its original premise. It has found its own identity as a proper family comedy slash series, with plots for the rest of its ensemble. Some of them were even better than the boy genius recent arcs. Because of this, young Sheldon's priority is to send off the Coopers satisfyingly. Seeing adult Sheldon and Amy is a great way to reference the Big Bang Theory and honor the prequel's parent show, but it isn't mandated to pay tribute to it, especially since it has several existing arcs to tackle. This shouldn't be surprising, considering the Coopers' absence in the Big Bang Theory final despite it being one of Sheldon's most important moments. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe my young Sheldon24 to our channel and stay with us.